Inside scoop from CNN, you're not going to believe the cabinet meetings of the president of the United States, and I mean Biden, his closest advisors are all scripted. What he's going to ask, what they're going to say in return, what he's going to say in return to what they said, everything is written out by staff. There's no open exchange of ideas. This is insanity. People need to know about it. We're going to tell you more. Now that Biden's gone as running for re-election in 2024 in November. Oh, he's gone? He's still the president of the United States. Oh, I, I thought he stepped down. Yeah, you, you would think, but here's what's weird. The cabinet meetings that are held are supposed to be regular because the cabinet advises the president and makes all the policy with the president. It turns out that the cabinet meetings, even the ones that they allowed reporters in, like this one. Some of the reporters are now starting to leak that the cabinet meetings are completely choreographed, meaning Biden's questions are choreographed. The answers by the cabinet officials are all written out. Biden's follow-up questions to the cabinet officials are all written out. In other words, oh there's goodness. a script. There's not a true discussion to formulate policy where they talk to the guy in charge of labor and the gal in charge of the environment and the guy in charge of the defense of the United States, you know, the advisors that help the president run the country, that it's all literally written out to the point <laughs> of call on secretary so-and-so now. And then secretary so-and-so has got a script at 10 Oh five president calls on you. You ask this question. And then the president has a script, what he says. It's all written out. Who is running the country, Will? Barry, this is, I mean, imagine what the enemies are thinking when they see this and they hear this. If, if we know it, they know it. Uh, of, of course. If we're sitting here talking about it, you know they know it. They probably knew it before we did. This is highly embarrassing. It's disturbing. And they want to continue this. And Kamala Harris is even worse than this. And then, and then of course, because Joe Biden, who he is, if he's going to call on anyone, they have to have his name, their name on a card so he can call out their name. Because other than that, he can't remember the people that's been in his cabinet for the past three and a half years. Even though he's talked to them every day, he still doesn't remember their names. And I'm surprised he remembered Kamala Harris's name. He's barely remembering Joe Biden's name. But totally this... True. This is this is highly disturbing, Barry. Where's the the man that's in that chair in the White House is supposed to be the best. He's supposed to represent the best of all of us. We don't have that currently. Well, and who's yeah. running the country? It's probably it's probably the the military complex, right? It's probably these the special interests. It's it's not Joe Biden and it's not Kamala Harris. It's more likely Barack Hussein Obama, Hillary Rodden Clinton. Nancy Pelosi, Chuck Schumer, and other elitists with George Soros. Very well could be. The most powerful man in the world is senile, suffering from Alzheimer's, probably has all kinds of diseases like Parkinson's and other things that people are guessing. And between now and January, we're in trouble if anything catastrophic happens. We really, really are. And I think something is going to happen. I think something catastrophic is going to happen before this November. Look what just happened when on the stock exchange. Down, down was it went down what twenty eight hundred points. Yeah, it's it's collapsing because there's no confidence in the country. No, no, not at all. And this, but you know what, Barry? This is that's by design. The whole build back better. The whole build back better was to tear down the world economies. I think I mentioned that to you before, didn't I? Yeah, absolutely. We've talked yeah. about. It. The Inflation Reduction Act blew up inflation. Yeah, that's so, the whole world they, economic form. They, that's what it's about. They, they name things the opposite of what the policy does. 100%.